What is up, good people of the internet? <clears throat> As you can see, back again with another short mini video, but uh, I just woke up. I wasn't really planning on recording anything today. <laughs> um, <coughs> and I'm feeling a little under the weather as well, so uh, this is just an off-the-cuff kind of video because I really wanted to uh, talk about something specific and open up this box for you. Um, so, for those of you who collect comics, um, especially if you collect hardcover comics, you know that there are a, cu a couple, you know, omnibus and things out there which are, people consider to be white whales, right? Like, things that are out of print and um, pretty difficult to find. So, there's a couple of these on my list, and uh, I have a practice of going through every, you know, probably once a day, maybe twice a day if I'm feeling crazy, and basically checking um, listings on Amazon and eBay and seeing if any anybody's selling these things, like new listings for these. So, basically, I did that the other week, and uh, I happened across a copy of the Garth Ennis Punisher Omnibus, which... Um, is very expensive and a lot on a lot of people's list of things like that they would wish that they could pick up. Um, and I got it for <coughs> what I would consider to be a really good deal. I'm not going to say like in the grand scheme of things, it's the best deal in the world. I paid a hundred dollars for this book. Um, usually if you want to go out and buy it right now, it's about $350. I think you could find a copy, but I've seen them go online for about five to six, depending on the condition. So, I immediately snagged this, and I thought, you know, regardless of the condition, I at least have a copy of this book, <coughs> hopefully, and it arrived this morning, mere moments ago, so I'm going to, uh, I'm not usually a fan of unboxing videos, I have to say, I, I don't really understand the point of them, like, I would rather see big haul videos, but I will today be unboxing and experiencing for the first time on camera um, what this looks like. It, it is from uh, Book Bite <laughs> Textbooks, uh, the textbook way to save, it says. So, I don't know how they would have come across this. I guess maybe somebody was selling books back to them and sold uh, an omnibus back? I don't know how that would work. But it shipped out from uh, UPS, and then it got taken into USPS, and so, it um, yeah. But here it arrived. Uh, the packaging is not... Amazing. Uh, you, I can hear the book sliding around in there. Um, but, you know, for a hundred bucks, we'll see what we get. So, let's rip this bad boy open and, and find out. <laughs> I'm just, I mean, I've never done an unboxing video before, so I don't know if people want to see how I'm opening it. But, basically, it's just held together with two pieces of this, like, reinforced tape. Um... I don't have my trusty Trader Joe's knife on me at the moment, which is an oversight on my part, but <clears throat> let's see what this is. I posted that I had found this on a, on a collecting forum that I'm part of on Facebook that when I had bought it for $100 and everybody was kind of like freaking out and saying like, oh man, they're probably going to miss ship you the book or whatever, like... I was thinking the same thing, too. I thought maybe it was going to be a different book that they were just mistaking for the Omnibus, but the weight of this package makes me feel like it probably is the correct book. So. <laughs> I can see already. No, no packing material at all, which is great. That's hilarious. But this is it. This is the right book. Uh, condition, not good. It's listed as good online. I would say, I would say good it is passable. Inventory location, condition used may include moderately worn cover writings, marks, or slight discoloration. Um, and I'd say this probably has all of those things. Uh, it has a little, little sticker on the side. Um, the, the, the whole uh, top of the dust jacket is pretty 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 murfed up on the bottom too but uh but it's not so bad if the book itself is in okay condition 
Let's find that out. The dust jacket is uh, is pretty sketched. I don't know if you can see it, but there's some tears and stuff in there. But, you know, the Punisher Omnibus. Uh, there's some bending around the around the corners and stuff. Like, it, it definitely looks like it's seen better days. But... The binding looks really good. It's not bad at all. Uh, it seems like and all the pages are holding together. There's a little bit of stick here and there. But um, a little bit of weird discoloration here and there too. But actually, I think... That looks pretty darn good. I'm pretty happy with that. I mean, I wouldn't say it is, it's not like you buy something for $100 and it's like a sealed brand new mint copy. You know, it definitely has, has its, its dings and, and problems. But uh, considering what, you know, people will shell out online for a chance to even get this or, or read it at all. Oh, I just opened to a, a lovely spot where this guy has all of his legs cut off. <laughs> All of his, I mean, he only had two legs, but he could. So yeah, um, this is the Punisher Omnibus from Book by Textbooks. Uh, shipping was was horrendous, uh, as you can see. It was just this this box with the book inside of it, and I don't know if that it led to uh, these problems specifically, or my guess is that they were kind of fudged up before um, if they were selling it as good. But yeah. There's an update. If you uh, are someone on the Omnibus Collector Facebook group, here's the update about what happened with the Punisher Omnibus. And if not, I hope you just enjoyed watching me unbox this and see what the heck I actually paid for. So I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, give me a like and subscribe as always, and I will see you guys in the next full one. <clears throat> I'm not sure uh, if that's going to be probably Wednesday or Thursday because, like I said, I'm feeling uh, a little ill. So uh, it's not exactly high on my priority list to record something if my voice is going to be all shit for it so but i hope you enjoyed this one and i will see you guys next time thanks for watching